I ain't gonna lie, bruh. I miss Hennessy. I miss taking shots and getting lit for, for my fam on YouTube, bruh. It's... <sighs> February can't get here fast enough. YouTube, what's the goddamn deal, man? It's one and only Pap G, and we are back with another video. And today, we are talking about some old Sprinter Van business. You know what I mean? Sprinter Van business. All right, so before we get to that, hit the like button, turn it blue, and subscribe if you're new. Let's get it, bruh. So shout out to everybody that's new to the channel, man. All the new supporters, man. All the new subscribers, welcome, welcome, welcome. Y'all been showing love to not only the Sprinter Band videos, but all my content. We've been going up, and those be going crazy. 2K on the way. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. But um, shout out to Lee. He inspired me to make this video. He, well, he asked me to make the video. He wanted me to talk about the type of freight I use, well not use, I take and uh, the type of contract that's out there. He wanted me to explain if it's good or bad. So I only have one contract on hand and we gonna, we gonna read it and see if uh, if it's a good contract. I'm gonna give y'all my opinion if it's good or not. So stay tuned and let's get it, bruh. So it's a few things that I look for in a, uh, a contract or agreement. It's how much they pay, how they pay, when they pay, if there's any more fees in the end of this bit that's coming out my check. Uh, and what else, what else, what else? And how long you gotta work for them, bitch? Cause some of these contracts, they don't, they don't be telling you when you talking to them, but some of them, they want you to be signed on to them for a year. You can't do work for nobody. Me, I'm gonna do what I wanna do, you know what I'm saying? Cause I'm the, I'm the, I'm the, I'm the owner operator. You know what I mean? I'm not an employee, I'm not an employee, you know? So uh, I got the contract right here. So I'm gonna read it and show y'all what we look for, man. Oh. Another thing, I'm gonna put all these videos in a playlist. It's gonna be called Sprinter Van Business. Not business, business. You know what I mean? Because uh, some people come to the channel and they see like my first one and I answer questions that they're asking in future videos. You know what I mean? Or the videos I already uploaded. So I'm gonna put all the videos in the playlist so y'all can go watch them in order and uh, all your questions will be answered. And plus I'm making this video, so this will be a no Passion information for y'all, all right? Now listen, I ain't no Sprinter Band channel. You know what I mean? So if you coming just to watch my Sprinter Band videos, I appreciate it, but I'm just letting y'all know now, that's not what the channel's about. You know, I'm a jack of all trades. I'm just I'm just being as transparent as possible. You know what I mean, on this channel. So I'm gonna show y'all, I'm gonna show y'all what I do for a living, my everyday life, my friends and shit, all, all, all that. Challenges, vlogs, all that. So if you like all that, Stick around, hit the subscribe button, man. You know, it's like I'm making these videos as informative as possible while making it entertaining. So make sure y'all stick around, hit that like button. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe to the channel, bruh. So, got the contract right here. Thick ass contract. But before we get into that, uh, one of the questions was, what type of freight do I carry? Uh, I take some of everything, bro. I, I done took some birds, some some hamsters. Uh, I, I take some of everything. You you name, I probably done took it. But now nowadays, I'm taking a whole lot of aircraft parts. So uh, I'm at the airport. I'm at both airports in Dallas. I'm at Love Field and I'm at DFW. So right now, I'm taking aircraft parts from one location to that location. All right. So he asked me the company name. And I don't mind telling you the company name, but if you out of Texas or out of out of Houston or Dallas, it's no point in me telling you what company I work for, you know what I mean? So you want the company that I work for and you're in Dallas or in Houston, DM me on Instagram, okay? And I'll tell you, I'll hook you up. So, well, we're gonna get into the contract. This is a pretty, a pretty general contract. You could Google this, just Google independent contract agreement, and it should pop up. About a 15, 16 page packet, you know what I mean? So, uh, like I said earlier, some contracts, they want you to work for about a year. And it says right here, duration of agreement and termination. This agreement shall remain in effect for a period of one year from effective date. I ain't gonna last a year, fuck that. I, I'm, I'm probably gonna do it from this company. You know what I mean? Just wasn't a good fit. But that's not the point. We're talking about good and bad contracts, all right? So sign, sign for you, okay? with most contracts yeah my thing said a year my agreement said a year but it didn't say i couldn't work for other companies so that's what i'm doing i was working for them this company and i'm working with another company so double dipping gotta get the most money i can get you know what i mean now 
this part of the damn agreement is compensation. So we had agreed to do 70% of each load. And, you know, it's that's that's good. Honestly, it's good. You know, become because some people are only paying some companies that I've seen, they're only paying like either half or 60%, but this company's paying 70% of each load. So if you're busy, you can make some money, bro. If you if you're taking them long drives, you know, you can make some money. So it's just how this company do it. You know how some people when you start one week in the hole, this company start two weeks in the hole. You know what I mean? And I knew that and I still took it because, you know, this was in a minute. We still in a pandemic. You know what I mean? So I was trying to make some money, trying to get working. Cause I got a van though. I gotta pay my van though. I gotta pay my bills. You know what I mean? So I took the contract and I settled. It was it wasn't bad. It just, like I said, my last video, I was getting overworked but underpaid. You know what I mean? I ain't like that. And I got burnt out from driving. It just I shouldn't be driving all over Texas every day. Give me a break! God damn! Shit. Now it was still some like some questions about should I sign on to a company? Do I have my authority? What should I do? Now I'm gonna tell you, you should do what you can afford. Like if you can afford to get your authority, get your authority. You know what I mean? If you like driving, you wanna go all over the world, get your authority. But it's nothing wrong with leasing on to a company. It's just, you only getting 70% of each load leased on to a company. You know what I mean? And then you with a company, you're on their insurance. So you, it's, 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 it back to that. You know what I mean? So, uh, speaking of insurance, I have a cargo van, right? So they're charging me 135 a week for my van. That's, that's, that's a little still. And I took that because they told me I was going to be busy. You know what I mean? And so like my first couple of weeks, I was doing like local shit, like from the airport to the warehouse. And I think the first week I made like $98. So, how you gonna take 135 from 98? But he told me, he was like, I'm gonna waive that insurance fee because you ain't really make nothing this week. So I was like, cool. But 135 a week and you and you, you ain't really busy like that, that's a little steep. Now, this company is cool for bands, but if you got a box truck, this company's for you. So like I said, you want this company and you in Texas, Houston slash Dallas, DM me Instagram and I got you. So what I did with my insurance, cause I had, I put personal insurance on my van, obviously for everyday purposes. So I was like, shit, if I'm gonna be on any insurance, I'm gonna save myself some money and take my personal insurance off. And that's what I did. So, uh, like I said, this is a pretty general contract. You could Google this, just Google independent contract agreement and you can read all this for us. So I didn't want to read all of it. I just want to point out the biggest thing that was for me, which is how you pay how much they pay and the fees they take out. So this contract, it's it's a it's a decent contract. And I ain't I ain't really got nothing bad to say about the company. It just it just wasn't a good fit. For me. It might be a good fit for you. So like I said, you want this company? DM me on Instagram. Alright? So I hope this is another informational video. Like I said, if you got any questions, leave them down below and I'll make another video. But all these Sprint Band videos be in the playlist. It should pop up right here. If it don't pop up right here, it's gonna be in the playlist. So I appreciate all the love and support. Appreciate all the comments, man. Y'all been y'all been giving me some kind words and comments. You know what I mean? Y'all like the video, that's what I mean. Y'all follow me on Instagram. Y'all just been y'all just been showing love. And that just that just keeps me motivated to keep going and give y'all more content. So that's it for the video. Hope you enjoyed. Like I said, leave a comment. Got more questions. Follow me on Instagram, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and I'm out, bruh.